<laughs> Yo, what up guys and welcome back to another one. Today, 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 something extremely, extremely requested. I've had this requested for, I don't know, well over a year. The Solo Duck Hunt Challenge. We're going to the public marsh. Got a nice little fire spot, let me tell you what. Tons of teal there. We're going to see if we can get some birds decoying. We're going to see if we can get a solo limit today. Oh yeah, oh yeah, we did the Dove Solo Limit Challenge, now we're gonna do the Duck Solo Limit Challenge. But first, oh boy, we just got those Early Riser hoodies and those Early Riser hats back in stock. They're both back in stock, I will link them down in the description if you want one, go pick one up. But yeah, a ton of you have requested this video and the Solo Dove hunt I did, oh my goodness, it was so, so rewarding. I mean, solo hunts are so rewarding, that Dove hunt, uh, I had to work my butt off to limit out. You guys are absolutely enjoying that video, so I just imagine, man, a duck hunt will be just that much better. So that's what we're gonna do today. Some of you may not have seen these, but we got the big truck and trailer decals available as well. It's a two-in-one sticker. You cut it right there and you get two big old stickers for the price of one. But I'm wasting no more time. Let's get on the road. Got about a 30-minute drive. Gotta go by the quick shop. Gotta get the caffeine like usual. You know the routine. Let's roll. I'm clean up, yeah. She's in love with who I am. A little bit of jamming on my way. Jamming on my way to the marsh. Jamming on my way to the field. Oh man, I miss it so much. I'm so glad it's here. The public marsh video where I caught the duck. Oh my goodness. You guys absolutely love that video. Um, right now as we speak, I uploaded that video yesterday and it is literally taken off like a firecracker or a bottle rocket, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, the video where I caught the duck, um, yeah, it was an epic moment. I knew it was going to be insane, but that video is going insane. As a lot of you have seen, if you follow me on Instagram right here, that video basically went Instagram viral. It's my biggest post I've ever done on Instagram. So just a very proud moment i want to say thank you to all you guys that are uh new subscribers to the channel and new viewers and all the long time viewers too real quick i love doing this we're at the beginning of the season i really want to do this if you guys could please drop a comment down below and either a day and or a subscriber count let me know when you subscribe to the channel it's very interesting and it's a way for us just to build the community and see when we all got on board Thank you guys, and I appreciate it. Now, let's get to the marsh. So, I'm pulling in uh, to the public parking lot here. Uh, so I'm gonna vlog right before we get out because I'm running a little late. Uh, it's about 40 minutes until shooting light, and my buddy called me and actually asked me, he was like, hey, are you still going up north? And I said, yeah. He said, well, me and a buddy are already here. Come join us if you want. So, Chase, the one you've seen on the last video, him and a buddy's here, so they're going to be sitting on the other side of the marsh somewhere. Uh, I'm going to go try to get me a spot. He said there was one other truck here on this side already. Uh, so hopefully it's just two trucks. Won't be too bad. Won't be too much uh, competing going on. We're getting ready to pull into the parking lot right here. What do we got? What do we got? Chase's truck and one other. There we go, boys. Heck yeah. It'll be a good one. Just enough to keep the birds bouncing, that's what we want. So I'm gonna be getting in my waders, I'm gonna be carrying my dozen decoys, my mojo, my gun, my backpack, so I'm, this is gonna go away for a minute. I will open it back up when we get sat down. Oh, well, wow, I'm sweating. I just got my glasses unfogged. Um, I brought a dozen decoys with me. As you can see, the camera is shaking. My hand is shaking. I've been working my butt off. So I got my mallard mojo and I have half a dozen teal and half a dozen big ducks. Two of them being those painted coot decoys. And they worked last time, so I'm going to keep running them. But it was a heck of a haul out here. We have about three minutes till shooting light. I always wait until the first shot goes off. Um, that's just how I've always done public hunting and making sure it's after a shooting light, of course, but it's a lot better today. We don't have overcast, so the low light conditions on the GoPro should be a bunch better. So I'm gonna put down the camera. Let's roll. That's one thing about these solo hunts. They let you get out here and really experience it for yourself. I just had about five birds land it. Oh, there they go. Well, it's shooting light. I was waiting for it to get a little light out before I turned the GoPro on. Well, I let those birds get out of the spread and didn't shoot at them. 
Uh, there was some popping going off right at shooting light, but now it's really calmed down. We're about five minutes in. Dang, they're getting into them up north. So guys, I haven't even popped off a shot yet. The shooting is a lot slower today. I, I know opening day, what, two, three days ago? Today is Tuesday. Opening day was Saturday. There was a bunch of hunters here on opening day. And I know this thing got blasted to smother, smithereens because I was here, but I was only about a half a mile north. Uh, I think this place really just got banged out. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, missed him. Dad gummit. First shot of the day, I whiffed that bad boy. Come on now, give me another one. They're getting into him up north. That's the honey hole. Boy, howdy, I seen these guys coming at me. I was like, oh my goodness. <laughs> got him. Oh my goodness, I barely pulled that shot off. Oh, I do not understand how I pulled that shot off through the weeds. That was epic. Now if I can find him right here. Where'd you go, bud? Barely got the camera on. I hope I got it on for that. Dang. Oh, first bird of the day. Uh, they came in hot, a pair did, and I literally turned on the GoPro, whipped my gun through the weeds, I hope you guys seen that, and nailed him. Can't believe I got him. Yay! Big thumbs up. Solo hunt is not a botch. I am happy with that. One bird down, we're about, I don't know, 20 minutes in, uh, after shooting light here. Yellow. So this is slow as hell. Yeah, it's extremely slow. How are you guys doing? I got one on the board. It's slow. Extremely slow still. Uh, let's get a time check here. 7.46. And this is our little itty bitty spread we got going on. You know how it goes. Give it your best. That's all you can do out here, guys. No birds, no birds flying. It's so nice being out here again all summer long. I was magnet fishing, which I love magnet fishing, don't get me wrong, I love it. All my magnet fishing viewers out there, shout out to you guys for watching my duck hunts. Uh, but I love getting out here and duck hunt. That's, that's what really gets to me. Well, I just missed a teal, went right over me. Darn it. That sucks, that teal, a teal just went vroom and I was messing with my camera. Oh, got one down, my gun jammed. Darn it, what the heck? That's the first gun jam of the season, boys, and it was when three wanted to land in my spread. Well, at least I got one down, darn it. Why did it do that? They just shot at the two that I didn't get to shoot at, but I did down the one right by the mojo. So, two birds, baby, two birds, heck yeah. It slapped it back and that shell got stuck right in there just like that, but I have no idea why that happened. Well, that feels good. Let's go pick her up. Yeah, buddy. They did it perfect. And I mean perfect. Very good chance. They did it so well that I could have probably maybe got all three of them. That was uh, heartbreaking, but good at the same time. Well, there he is. Heck yeah. Two on the board, baby, two on the board. Let's see if we can get another. I cannot believe my gun jam. It might be time to clean her. I haven't cleaned her probably four hunts. They're coming back to the marsh pretty good now. A lot of groups I've heard shooting a little bit more, so maybe it'll start ramping up a bit. The solo hunting is always great. I did that dove hunt and I ended up limiting it out and it was great. It was awesome limiting out, but ducks, you know, is not near as easy as dove. At least that's how I look at it, especially when it comes to public hunting right after opening weekend. This place got absolutely destroyed. So the amount of hunters on a weekday was kind of shocking. I, I did not imagine that there'd be that many hunters here on a freaking Tuesday. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine, 12. Always count your decoys, make sure you got them all, fellas. And gals, another thing. Any gals out there watching, any duck hunting gals, drop a comment down below. I don't mean to leave you guys out when I always say boy and boys and what's up boys and 
yeah buddy always referring to dudes but if there's any girls out there that are duck hunters that watch the channel drop a comment down below i appreciate y'all watching i know this hunt wasn't as exciting as i wish it was but if you guys appreciate it you guys like it still you know what to do drop me a big old thumbs up ah now it's time for the long walk so I don't know if you can see that tree row way over there. Probably not with this GoPro, but I'd say it's about three quarter of a mile walk for me for chasing them way back yonder. Hey, <laughs> they got a mile walk at minimum. So I don't mean to be a gripe or a pain in the butt, but I see a ton of empty shells. My hands are full. I mean, I've seen a bunch. It's, it's kind of depressing to be honest. Guys, if you guys want to keep our public lands, our public marshes, wetlands open and available to hunt, keep them clean. It's a privilege. So always think about that. Put it in the back of your mind. Pick up your empties, guys. How you doing? How'd you guys do? But two birds, those two fellas shot five. I know Chase and his buddy, I think they shot three. So those two fellas have done the best that I've heard of yet. I shot two, not too bad, didn't limb it out. Uh, it quickly turned into the can Bobby down a duck challenge. Um, had them sit in the decoys. The ones that I actually shot came, out, came in right over the decoys. The, one, the first one I shot, let me get my words here. First one I shot came over the decoys so fast that I had to turn on my GoPro and once I shot him, my gun was in the weeds. I can't even believe I smoked that guy. But if you guys like the solo hunts, please let me know by giving me a big old thumbs up. I know this wasn't the most entertaining, crazy shooting pile them up video, but the solo videos, this is what it's about. Getting out here by yourself and just enjoying it. Again, the early riser hats and the hoodies are available. We also got new barrel stickers in and all new decals so any of that stuff if you want to pick it up i'll link it in the description below go check it out anything that you guys purchase from the ducks website goes directly to supporting the channel and helping me keep doing these videos for you guys so i appreciate every purchase thank you so much subscribe if you haven't we're going to keep the duck hunting and goose hunting coming all year again thank you for watching we'll see you on the next one Peace.